That's blow on the side. Oh, nice, nice. There's the warp here. I'm just getting all sorts of warp pads. But I think we are gonna do this. I guess we are gonna go to the. into here. The hole in the wall? Yep. Oh, wow. This is my thing. You can see Jig over here. We cannot get it yet. We need to get Glide. We're gonna see if the if the j if the Jiggy's down here. The, the what? In the fish. Oh, in the fish. Oh, I understand. And it looks like it's not. Oh, Cheeto Page. And we don't want that. We do not want that. And so we are gonna go blow up the thing if I can find it. That's an, there we go. Oh, there it is. It's the thing with the giant face on Kazooie on it. <laughs> he was waiting for you. Yeah. Just plotting. <laughs> plotting. The fish and their plots. Which they learned from school. Fish school, apparently, yes. <laughs> 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 I failed to catch that, actually. Yeah. You know, the, they're the fox that, you know, when they just swim around, it's called school. Yeah, I guess, yeah. I mean, now I know. That's good. It's good stuff, yeah. So now we're in Grunt Industries in the basement. We actually have air here, so we better be quick. So you saw the world here. Da, 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 da. New preview. There's a jig in that container over there. But <laughs> K Man you... just pointed to the screen. I don't <laughs> no know. one. Yeah. I, I, I pointed to the screen. You can't really see me pointing because <laughs> we're not recording me. That's rather pointless. But, but Sam, but Sam could see me pointing, and then oh, I, I did. So he just passed it on for you. Yes. A gift from me to you. <laughs> Pretty much. Now we're just gonna swim back to Atlantis. This little crack. Good. Good. It's a good thing. <laughs> it's a good thing. Not much room to maneuver here, but we're doing alright. And there we go. Here we go, the sea anemones with one eye. We we're already in this world, but now we can break this one thing. And that is a UFO. For and it's an actual UFO. But they're, and they're just really stereotypical aliens. We're not going to waste time talking to them. It's a fake ginger up there. It looks like eggs can now power crystals from out of this world. Pretty much. So that's how... Oh, and time limit, apparently. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> here we go, last crystal. Alright, powered up. We got it. Late for dinner, very yeah. important. And these guys show up again in Hailfire Peaks, which is World 7. So you gotta get them out, you gotta save them here so they appear in there. In a later date. No, I don't want to do it. Apparently, shooting laser beams in your own ship does not hurt it, in fact. Yeah, they're just celebratory laser lasers. <laughs> like, yeah, they are peaceful Martians. Yep. Which is good. That's the kind you like. How they crashed here, I have no idea. It doesn't make sense think, yeah. in the slightest, does it? I don't think so. I mean, apparently, not very good oh, navigation. Not. And that's where the hole came from. So they didn't know there's a whole other world under there. Wow. Before that thing crashed. Snowy Mountain, which is obviously... Yeah, Hailfire Peaks. Yeah, there we go. Sam didn't know what it was. Huh? Oh, Hailfire, yeah. Yeah, you motioned the me to name it. Yeah. And we're actually only going to get seven Jiggies on our first playthrough, because three of them you need to, you need to backtrack from, from other worlds. That's kind of a Are, are we going to fight the boss in this one? Yeah, yes, we're, yes. You, you fight a boss. Looks like your shadow was freaking out for a second there. Apparently did not like how you were swimming. My shadow? Yeah. I was on, in, on the floor, yeah. I don't know if you really need shadows, but well, that's a cool yeah, touch. Yeah, it's just... And it's just it. <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't know whether it wants to be there. You know, I don't think there's any sun here, so it'd be tough to have. And I have just finished my root beer. Sad moment. Oh darn! Uh, so I go better go get another one. Yeah, well eventually I will. I mean, I mean there's no rupee here. We didn't even get that warp before. Oh, <laughs> that's good yeah. because in case we were I was planning to warp back, we wouldn't have been able to. But 
decided to take an alternate route. It's very handy. And I still have not found the one fish with... It's I want to say it's in this area? It's pro yeah, there, there, there it is. It is. Uh, Which is with the little globo, happily enjoying his time underwater. Mm -hmm. There we go. Poor fish. No, he's fine. He's still sewing around. Oh, is he? Yeah. Oh, well, good. You, you, good you don't kill him. You just go through him. Oh. So, good for him. Apparently, Wumba likes to half submerge her. Yeah, yeah. it's hot. Yeah, this, this, just, this, just, just this one. Oh, I'm pretty sure Badger would give anything <laughs> that right. Wumba wanted. <laughs> <laughs> he's kind of hot. So now we're returning to submarine. Which get, is pretty awesome. Get two TVs. And hopefully, hopefully these will be our, our last two jiggies. Because you get one jiggy later when you go up to the surface when you rescue that one chick. Yes, yeah, so, the one chick. Yeah. <laughs> so if we have four now, then we'll have, then we'll get the two of the submarine and then one from rescuing the, the one chick. And then we'll be done for now. Assuming we have all the Jinjos. A submarine wearing pants. Yep, it's crazy. That is a sight to see. Pants and a backpack. <laughs> this work. seems a lot easier to maneuver in, though, too, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. You can't warp to the town because they're just not... <laughs> there's, there's land there. There's land there, and you can't really go on the land well. So can you blow up those other lockers? No, just one with a crack in it. Oh, makes sense. You can only go down here to the submarine because it's really deep. Too much pressure. Too much pressure, but the submarine can handle it. Submarines are built for that. Yeah, they had this one submarine that went down to look at the Titanic. Yeah, that was pretty deep, right? Oh, yeah. Thousands. And I accidentally read, went through the instructions. Okay, <laughs> well, that didn't take too long. So we're just gonna run, around, go around, and just shoot everything. Just keep hitting the trigger button. Probably have to keep pressing. You can't hold it down. Obviously, like you noticed, the blue are worth three, three. and then the green are worth what two? Two. Red are worth one. one. That's how it is the entire game. The blue is my favorite color, so it makes sense. And yeah. the red's my least favorite color. And they do cater to the player, well, so not least favorite, but least favorite out of the trio of colors. So it works out well. Kind of about how they didn't use yellow and go with the primary colors, but maybe they just thought yellow was just well, not cool enough. Well, maybe they game. went for the the visual the visible light spectrum. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. I mean, they try to mix make things a bit more advanced. I mean, not many people know the visible light spectrum. If you got if you bought one of those new those one of those TVs with the yellow light on them. Oh yeah. You know, with the one Asian scientist being a dick about it. <laughs> And I'm pretty sure you've already far surpassed the goal, right? Yeah. What was the goal? 60. 60, yeah. Well, there we go. And then I think we can replay this for absolutely nothing, right? Well, for fun. For fun, oh yes. I don't find this. Endless hours of fun. Minigames. That's, that's a, a blast. It's a good time. But now we got to find the Jiggy. And it's right there. This is the only time where we can explore the area without it. And once we get the Jiggy... We're done.